Hey, this is Paul from Wondershare Mobile Trans. And today we wanna to show you how you can move your WhatsApp chats from an Android over to an iPhone for free. And it really is free. So how are you doing today? Let us know in the comments below as well, because we are genuinely interested in how you guys are doing who watch our videos. Also, if you're new around here, why not subscribe to the Mobile Trans YouTube channel so you don't miss out on any of the videos that we upload that give you these tips and tricks, which really help you with some of your devices. So you might be stuck on something and you really want to know the answer, then Mobile Trans should have that answer. But Let's get into today's video and show you how you can move those WhatsApp chats from an Android to an iPhone for free. In the past couple of weeks, I have switched my phone from a Samsung phone going to the iPhone 12 Pro. And one of the things that I didn't want to lose when making that transfer was those WhatsApp messages. And people have asked me, how was I able to transfer those messages from an Android phone over to an iPhone? Transferring those WhatsApp messages over from an Android to an iPhone has been a bit of a myth. There's so much information out there that tells you how you can do it, but none of that is that accurate. And of course, one of those main reasons that it is really difficult to do this is because Android and iPhones just don't really talk that well to each other. So when you wanna transfer data over, it actually becomes a little bit difficult and nothing is as straightforward as it seems, especially when you want to try and move those messages from WhatsApp from an Android to an iPhone. But the iPhone was not made by Apple to be its own loan product. The main thing with iPhone and its software is it doesn't really let you connect to other things only because of the cyber security that it has in the iPhone. And that is never really a bad thing. It is almost impossible to transfer WhatsApp chats from Android to an iPhone unless you have somebody to show you how to do that. And that is what I'm here to show you today. If you're lucky enough to have had an Android phone and then want to go and buy an iPhone and you want to take those chats over with you, this is the part where it can get a little bit complicated. That's because swapping WhatsApp chats from an Android to an iPhone, even though it's within the same app of WhatsApp, it's not officially available. And then that becomes a little bit frustrating. One of the reasons being that when you use Android and WhatsApp together, what it tends to do there is use Google Drive to back up all of its data on the cloud. Whereas if you're doing it on an iPhone and using WhatsApp there, it then stores all that data in iCloud instead of utilizing Google Drive. And you might think that, well, these two are cloud-based storage systems. Them. So surely it is easy to synchronize all the data between the two. And that just isn't the way it is. And then that means sometimes you have to then rely on third party options to try and move all of those chats and data over. But luckily I am here to show you how to do that. And the first way that we're gonna show you how to do that today is actually by sending those WhatsApp messages from Android to iPhone using email. And this is something that is not that well known amongst the community. So luckily you are gonna hear about it here. The first thing you'll need to do is grab your Android phone and of course open up WhatsApp. The first thing to do is go to settings and then select chat settings. You should then see a screen that says chat history and that is the next thing that you'll need to click on. Then just tap export chat. On the following screen, you'll then be asked which contact and what chat you would like to send over as an email. Once you've selected that contact, the next option then is a little bit of a pop-up that says to email that contact. And this is where you can either use the phone's inbuilt email or if you're a Gmail user, then select Gmail because that is what is gonna work best for you. This though is where you should use your most secured email because you don't want to have any of this information getting out to anybody that might not know who you are or who your friends are. Once that has been sent, it should only take a couple of seconds and then go to your email on your iPhone and there you have it. That chat that was just on your Android phone is now being emailed over to your iPhone so you can view it whenever you need. I mentioned it earlier on and this is quite an uncommon method. So hopefully now that has helped you out. And if you know someone else that is looking to do the same, then why not share this video with them so they can have a look at this as well. Let's give you a bonus tip before this video ends and that is to use a piece of software called Mobile Trans. Mobile Trans is a really good piece of software that lets you transfer data from one phone over to another. And if you've not downloaded this before, then now is the time. You can find a link in the description to take you to the official Mobile Trans website where you can download this and then use its tools to help you move those WhatsApp chats. Once you've downloaded it, you'll of course need to make sure that you launch the Mobile Trans app first of all and make sure that you connect your Android phone. 
A really good thing about the Mobile Trans software is that it works on both Mac and PC. So no matter which one of these operating systems that you have, you can be helped out by this system. When you go back into the Mobile Trans software, you need to select Backup Your Phone. On your desktop view, you would see three sections on the Mobile Trans app interface. On the right side of your screen, you will see that a selection on the interface is further divided into halves. Click backup on that section of the interface and you will automatically see a new display with a new set of prompts. Here is then when you select your file type and you're not limited by your choice of selection either. You can choose to select any file type as long as it has a file classification on your device. Remember to choose your WhatsApp files and boom, there we go. The only thing you need to do then is click start and Mobile Trans will do all the hard work for you while you sit back and relax and then give it a couple of minutes and it should all be done. The bottom line is there is no official way to move those chats over from Android to iPhone, but hopefully this video has given you some really good tips. And of course, the best option here is to use that Mobile Trans software because of how quick, easy and efficient it can be with moving over data. To download that Mobile Trans software, take a look at the description where you will find a link to get what you need. If this video helps you out in any way, then why not subscribe so you don't miss any videos like this coming up in the next couple of weeks. Comment below on what actually helped you and why not share it with a friend as well so you can help them out. And if you do all of that, then we will see you on the next video.